and Pedro Martinez Loza. He's been the Scotland manager since July 2021. Narrowly failed to get to the World Cup finals in 2023. They've shown great progress. Both sets of players take the knee ahead of kickoff to show opposition against racism and all other forms of discrimination. Here we go then, underway at Hampden. Lauren James over to the far side and well defended by McLaughlin. We'll keep you updated on that as well. Swung in by Alex Greenwood and curls all the way. And Esme Morgan gets there. Oh, Mary Ups with the ball to Lucy Bronze, who is caught late. Good challenge from Doherty. Flag is up against Beth Mead. Well, on first glance, it did look like the right decision. Serious knee injury. Good pressing from Stanway, and she receives the ball back. Charles delivers. Lauren Hemp. Plays it back to James, bit of a heavy touch, and the deflection takes it over the top. First corner of the game for England. I think what England did well there, they, they played. Nearly falls for Hemp. Kirby tried the little dink, toe poke. Over the top, first real chance. Bronze. For marauding runs, Windsor. Oh, it's a free header. say that was poor, poor marking from Scotland, just what England needs. Early goal, and they are on their way. It's a great header from Alex Greenwood, brilliant delivery from Beth Mead, it's brilliant to have her back in the side, we know she contributes to so much. Doherty, bronze, Ooh. on top of the net, I'm not sure if that's what she meant. <laughs> it's one of those crotches. Get and be brave and vacate that area. James with the cross, could it be another? If they'd have any chance. Here's Evans, down she goes. Referee says, get to your feet. That looks very risky. Yeah, it did look risky. It's great to see her starting. Bronze tries to whip it in towards James. Should be well to wriggle away from Neve Charles. And then forces Mary Earps into a stop. Well, she perhaps wasn't expecting. Yeah, it's really good from Rachel McLaughlin. I mentioned that offensive nature that she has. She's a really strong attacking fullback. Pulling it back for Hemp. First touch wasn't ideal, and the second one wasn't great either. Giving Mead eventually delivers. Good against Beth Mead. That might be a questionable decision. Mead's cross over the head of Walsh. Delivers towards Beth Mead. That's a beautiful ball. Touch let her down. Oh, I just wonder, could she have hit that first time? I don't know if it was just a little bit ahead of her, but really good play. Good burst. Awkward. Bronze delivers low. Towards the back post. James still has it. Off the post. That is incredible. How on earth did Lauren Hemp miss that one? I have no idea how it stayed out the back of the net, but I'm also unsure. Esme Morgan. Emsley, right across the face of goal. Lovely touch. And here comes the cross, away from Joel. Claims for a handball against McLaughlin. Here's James, deflection, and it's there! The slice of luck that England might just need tonight. Again, a quick restart. England need more. No, back to James. It's Lauren James. It's another stunner. Two goals in two minutes. England starting to believe. Well, this is brilliant from Lauren James. The finish is superb, but what she does initially, she's staying in the middle. Charles is behind James, drifting into space.
Stanway, give and go to reverse here. James in behind, a bit of a heavy touch, but she's managed to pull it back, or has she? No, flag is up. She didn't quite get there in time. Delivers, finds Beth Mead. It's Mead! It's 4-0! Beth Mead! With her first England goal in 15 months! And as it stands, England... It's a big half-time team talk you need to say for the manager. So, Alex Greenwood, two from Lauren James, and an assist for James. But even to make that triple change, you know, right away they've come out. It looks like there's probably not a change to the shape, but... In England, with London City Lionesses, delivers a good low cross, well defended. England not... Absolutely not, it's the same message, isn't it? Score as many goals as you possibly can in the second half. Napier with an effort. Against China. England hungry for more, they extend their advantage, 5-0 they in towards Lauren Hemp, it's a difficult opportunity that one. You see Stanway trying to pick up Hemp, onto that left foot of hers and Kirby just hooks it wide. She's picked up, slips it through for Lauren James, it's a good cross, it hits. Here's James, through for Hemp! Brilliant save from Gibson. Might get another. Here's Charles, palmed up by Gibson. Taken by Greenwood. Excellent goalkeeping, kept alive by Charles. Oh, the likes of Aaron Cuthbert, Sam Kerr, to come and join the attack. Nick Thomas still on it. Delivers a decent looking ball. Deep towards the back post. Chance. Into the ground, away. Swept away by Georgia Stanway. I think Mary Earps had to bring it up well. Toon. Back to Russo. A little bit wild. Well, he's sold Mary Earps a little short. Earps does just enough. What an opportunity. Kirsty Hansen. Puts it wide. Greenwood delivers. Away by Howard. Greenwood's delivery. James fires over. Bursting forward. Russo got ahead to it. Cutting inside. Hemp towards Russo. Claimed by Lee Gibson for both of you so far tonight. <laughs> Back fairly. Charles, congested penalty area. Responsibilities are in the pitch as well. This could be a chance. Ooh. Progressing well. It's still Stanway. Block. Here's Walsh. Flex off Howard. Greenwood's delivery. Oh, nearly results in an own goal. Good hands from Gibson. It's Lisa Evans. Out the other side. Teed up for Cuthbert. To get this away. Brown delivers towards Thomas. Kept out by Earps. Off the post. And play stops for a foul. Well. England are not doing this the easy way at all. Soon for bronze. She's done it. England hit Scotland for six, and that might just be enough. Lucy Bronze with her third goal in the UA. That goal from Lucy Bronze might just have done it. They're still playing. Greenwood.
Stewart, two from Lauren James, Beth Mead, Frank Kirby and Lucy Bronze right at the death with perhaps the crucial goal for England. Well, what a night in Hamden. Celebrations can't start yet. The Netherlands might just score again.